I think everybody was so excited that the All-Stars were back and the fact that they were choreographing and being in the hot seat tonight put a whole nother edge on the whole entire program. The surprise for me tonight, I think, was when, when it came to voting who would be staying on the program. Jenna was only voted off by one vote. Tucker, we discussed his technical ability, which is fantastic, and uh, the cart papers went towards fiction. Next, we both have tour coming up, and we're super excited to go to all 42 cities. This experience in itself has just opened a whole bunch yeah. of windows and doors and pathways for us, so it's just a matter of what's next. I had Mark for Jazz. He was such a joy to work with. I feel like I ended on a great note. And working with Jenna was just a dream. I mean, she made the entire experience just very enjoyable. And it was nice because it was a different side to Jenna. So it was really, really nice to really try and draw that out of her. I had Courtney Galliano for jazz, and it was an experience to say the very least. I instantly connected with Tucker. He's an amazing partner and strong, and you know, we got to do the greatest love story ever told, Romeo and Juliet, and it was, it was awesome. I think the biggest surprise for me was certainly seeing Courtney out there dancing. I was diagnosed with MS about a year and a half ago, so I thought what better way to defy this disease than to dance. We are throwing something called the Beat MS Dance Walk, and it's on September 22nd at University High School. Bring all your friends. You guys can go to www.thebeatms.com. It's been really amazing, the support that the dance world has given, and so if you love to dance, you will love this event. Tonight I got to dance with Twitch. That was such an honor. And the dance, it was high energy hip hop. He's in love with superheroes. So I got to be a superhero tonight. I'm obsessed with the world of superheroes and comic books. I wish it was real. Jasmine was incredible, man. I've been saying she's a warrior. We could literally go into hand-to-hand -hand combat and, and, and win easy, because she's awesome. First of all, Haley, she's amazing. Uh, she, picks up, she picked up Rumba. I mean, to the point where actually she looked like she was doing ballroom for about two years. I got paired up with Dimitri this week and he was unbelievable to work with. In Roomba you have to have a lot of passion and you have to be like really into it with your partner. He taught me all of that and he was just unbelievable to work with. Oh my gosh, my graffiti hip hop piece, it was, I'm so excited about it. I just had an amazing time doing it with Paul, which is crazy because he's a ballroom dancer. But he was able to just take all of that and say, today I'm doing hip hop. At first I was very intimidated working with Comfort, but being a part of her choreography and dancing with her on stage was just out of this world and I'm so happy to have worked with her. Working with Amy was a pleasure. I chose the music because I wanted to pull out just a little bit more of a mature side of Amy. I've wanted to work with him for a while. He's kind of a legend on this show and like to have him stand on stage with me and like bring something out of me that I've never felt before was magical. When I found out I had fiction, something I really wanted to bring out of him was him being strong in who he is. Allison is a really awesome person to work with, and the piece itself was definitely something that was pretty touchy. For a while, I was really just focused on the dancing, kind of stressing myself out, and then she's just like, remember what the piece is about, show that you can come together and uh, dance together and be happy together, no matter what people say. I had a jive with Chelsea. All ballroom for me is hard, I'm a big guy. You know, jive involves very small and tight movements, and it was all very unfamiliar. She was so encouraging, and she made our rehearsals so fun. Couldn't have been happier with somebody, a professional, who really knows what she's doing. You know, she's with Dance with the Stars and everything, so I really lucked out. This question is for Jen Winling, so I just want to say hi, Jen. You always hit me up on Twitter. Um, well, I do love sleeping, that's for sure. Before I lay down, I like to play a little video game. I'm a big fanatic and obsessed with Criminal Minds and like Law & Order SVU. Personally, I love to eat in my free time. I love everything, but I would say probably ice cream. I have a little Rubik's Cube that I always play with and it just calms me down. Definitely eat pizza, which I'm really trying to cut back on because lately it's been giving me the worst stomach aches, but if I'm not sleeping, I'm eating some sort of pizza-like food. In my free time, I love to dance. I love it, I mean, I cannot stop dancing. Um, yeah, I love it, dance. What's going on, y'all? This is Steven Twitch Boss, and you are watching Dance Song. Stay tuned.